advertising. They just want to be in the video. Well, what we thought we'd do is we'd guide you around the shop and show you all the fantastic new amazing animals that we've had in this week. There's some really nice new royals, new different colour morphs, and we just thought we'll embrace taking you around the shop and letting you see what we've got. Sam, come and help me. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> right, what have we got going on, Sam? We've got some nice Euromastics. Okay, let's have a, a little look at them. They're fantastic. What, and can yeah. Oh, they're lovely. They're coming on lovely. These are captive bred here by some uh, one of our customers. Oh, they're gorgeous. Just starting to get a bit of colour. Let me grab the other one. Oh, we go. Well, this one's going more yellowy than yours. This yours one's going, going a bit more orange. Greeny. Orange. How oh, fantastic is that? Lovely. Okay, let's have a look and see what else we've got. Oh, this is a nice, we've got an albino radiated rat snake. Let's have a little look at him. Yeah, come in, lovely. Oh, look at I him. love the way that they do hold the fans, themselves it? flat. It's amazing, isn't it? Isn't that stunning? What's the age of this one now, Sam? It's about two years now. Gorgeous. It's holding on tight. There we go. Painted uh, wood turtles doing well. They've been mating, haven't they? They're, They're coming on really, really well. well. Just have a little look at the coloration, the markings these uh, are getting. Now these are really quite rare. Um, let me grab one out of the water. I suppose I'll go and wash my hands afterwards quickly. But just to show the coloration of how the shell and the head markings, they're stunning. These have been with us a little while now, haven't yeah. they? Very unusual very to find captive bread. Yeah, very underrated. They eat veg um, and come out and really are fantastic. Always active, always on the go. Yeah, you go to the next animal now and I'll just go and quickly wash my hands. Oh, are you recording? Look at this, Gary. Look at him. He's fantastic. Little baby field dragon. Isn't he adorable? I love the fact the way the head is so much bigger than the body when they're this age. He's nice markings. So cute. We've got some nice new uh, colour morphs of, of royals in. And these are really, really very pretty. Um, some of the morphs uh, don't show the colorations off as, as much, but this is a spider, and this is actually a really very pretty one. Have a look at that. Look at the head markings on that. It sort of has um, a granity effect, and it sort of all um, sort of the lines sort of change around, going around to much paler underneath the body. But an absolutely fabulous looking snake. And then we've got. Let's put that one back on. Put this back. On. And then we've got a pastel. Again, it's very important to me with the pastels to have such a, a contrast in colour. And I think actually, in all fairness, these are one of my favourites out of all the, the, the genetical changes that are going on at the moment. Because really, they're more traditional and keeping Still. a look to the to the original royal, oh. aren't they? You've not lost the aspect of the royal. Still. But it is, you know, really very, very pretty. All these three that we've got here are females, so that's great news. Um, and obviously, if anybody's trying to... Um, get a collection together then um, you know it's a great opportunity to take advantage of them hmm. the last one that we've got here is an albino uh, royal this is quite a pale one we've, this is a female but we've got a, a male um, albino royal in as well and the contrast is beautiful but that does mean that we've got an un oh lovely that does mean we've got an unrelated pair I think this is just coming up to shed can you view? The, can you video Sorry. the Sam there? No, I mean, you know, what a relationship. Thank I mean, you. That's brilliant. I didn't move. I didn't flinch.